everybody and welcome back to my channel or a big fat hello if you're new here welcome settle down get a cup of tea get some popcorn you're probably gonna need it for this video because I am nervous I'm nervous it's way too bright it's bright because that big fat rock in the sky is shining out how many people did I just trigger did I trigger you did I trigger you by calling the Sun a rock guys I need to give a formal apology to everybody who watched my recent vlog because I called the sun a rock and we all know it's gas and people aren't happy okay there are people okay you're not gonna be taking GCSEs this year but next year there'll be people taking the GCSEs and they'll be sat in the exam room thinking is the sun a rock or is it gas and they'll think oh like Meg said that one time in her intro it's a rock and they might lose marks you might not get into the school you want to go to and I'm just worried. So guys, for reference, sun equals gas, okay? I feel like I did know that. I feel like if I was in Who Wants To Be A Millionaire and the question came down to that, the million was down to that question, I think if I'd thought about it, I would've gone, yeah, gas, of course, I, I knew that, guys. But when you've got the camera in your face, you're vlogging, you're living your best life, you're about to do a makeover, sometimes words get the better of you and you end up calling the sun a rock. Okay, apology over, just wanted to get that out, wanted to, wanted to air that, okay? Because I think people are upset, I'm sorry. Today is quite a spontaneous vlog, I say that before every vlog, and that's because I do zero planning when it comes to vlogging, so they're all spontaneous. But I had a very exciting delivery yesterday. This blue parcel and this blue, it's not a parcel, it's a pile. Um, so I have teamed up with the lovely Silvermore who make fabulous haylage. They also make treats, which I will show you in a minute because they are exquisite. I mean, I wouldn't know because I've not tasted them, but the horses tell me that they are. As I said, I've teamed up with Silvermore and if you head over to my Instagram, still too bright, I'm actually hosting a giveaway with them. So you have the chance to win vouchers to get 10 bales or bags of haylage and a really nice goodie box of treats and their swingers, which is basically a ball type compressed grass game for horses, which are in the stable a lot. I mean, it's super sunny, the rock's shining. So we're, we're bringing our horses in a lot, aren't we? Because it's too hot for them to be outside and they get bored. And these swingers things basically just keep them entertained for a little bit longer, which is lovely. So they very kindly gifted me some haylage and I've opted for the light version because I have a lot of native ponies and they struggle to lose weight. Let me tell you that, guys. So this one is low protein, low sugar, it's low calorie and high fiber. So it's amazing for those ponies that kind of struggle to shift the pounds. I feel you guys, I feel you 100%. I know where you're coming from. And let me tell you guys, I've opened just one bag because it only arrived yesterday and I am here for it. I am here for this haylage. I love it, take a look. I'm so excited. What's this, Meg? It's my haylage delivery. Uh, who's look at Jam, can you see Jam? <laughs> Open it, human. <laughs> the horses are very excited. Oh, come on, Mum. Zoom in here. I'm Woo! very excited. I love Haley. Oh, God, I love the smell of it. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> That's Meg's tea sorted out. <laughs> wow. That so this is the good. light one. So it's low sugar and low calories for fatty ponies. You hear that, ponies? Low protein, low sugar, high fiber, designed for laminetics and to aid weight management. Well, there we what, go. Let's face it, on lockdown, it's what we all need. Yeah. <laughs> well, Yummy. we're going to give them all a handful and see what they think. Yes, we are. I think they're going to be very impressed. <laughs> Do you like this, it Meg? It's so nice. <laughs> it's going to make weird with how like, much I like it. Meg's it's a big so soft. Fat. It's like spaghetti. <laughs> no, honestly, come and touch it. Because I don't, you, you have to feel it to believe it. Look. Oh, wow. It is good enough to eat. Oh, I could sleep on that. <laughs> it is lovely. It smells absolutely divine. Oh. Should we go and give Jam a taste test? Yeah, okay. I'll come with you. I'm going to drop hay all over the sweat yard. Get back, get back, get back. Oh, she's flickering. <laughs> she's not. <laughs> oh, yeah. She says, oh, yeah, give me that. Give me that. Is that nice, Jammy? Better than that dry stuff you've been feeding us. Good girl. 
As you can see, I am a super big fan of this haylage. Sorry if I was a bit weird, but it also comes in other varieties if you want to check it out. They've got the original, they've got Timothy grass one, and they've also got a veteran one. Also, I forgot to say, this is really good for potential laminetics. Another thing I like is that all the nutrients is on the bag. You know, you can send your like hay and haylage away to get tested to see like the sugar levels and all of that. I mean, it's complicated and we all know, I'm not good at science, I'm called the sun a rock for Pete's sake. But I love the fact that you know exactly what is in every bag because often, if you're just buying big bales of hay or haylage like you don't know unless you get every bale tested because it varies so much depending on the grass anyway that's not really what this video is about so these arrived yesterday i'm looking at them i think god these are amazing packaging is beautiful 10 out of 10 look at this blue have you ever seen a bluer blue i think not that's quite blue the sky is quite blue but alas it's a gorgeous blue and i thought I like a filler that isn't it like if i went to a show and i saw a blue fence like this i'd be like oh that's quite spooky so i thought how can i prepare for that i could jump the haylage bales what a good idea they're perfect jump height they're just like little fillers aren't they i don't really know how i'm going to arrange them yet we're going to drag them into the school in a second but that's what we're going to do i'm going to get jam and i'm going to get bear moment of silence for the girl that has to jump bear over bright blue haylage bales you know what bear's like. I'm a bit nervous. Um, so I'm going to drag these into the school, put them out, put them under a fence and try and jump jam and bear over them. And I'm a bit nervous. I'm a bit worried because they have jumped once since we've been on lockdown and bear's really not jumped very much at all recently. I mean, obviously she has jumped in the past. We went to badminton and fell off. Um, but yeah, so I thought, why not take you guys along with me? Because you love to laugh at me. So that is what we're gonna do. And I don't honestly know how it's gonna go. Leave a comment below who you think is gonna go over first time. It's fine if you say neither of them, because honestly, I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Anyway, I'm gonna drag these down to the school. Tears flowing, because I'm scared. And I will catch up with you in a second. When I think about the way we used to be, when I think about the things it took from Every time I want to vlog or want to ride in a school, Dad starts chainsawing. What are you even chainsawing anymore? Might be a lot of music over this vlog, guys. Sorry for that. Um, but I've set up that fence. I've got like a support pole at the back so they can't flop down or anything. I'm gonna set up a little warm-up fence there and then go and get a pony first pony selected i've gone for the worst one i don't oh, i just don't know i was just saying to mum bear will jump the highest but jam's more likely to okay bears want to go in the arena <laughs> sprinklers on oh god yeah i forgot to say turn the sprinkler off we can turn the sprinkler off this is a no pain never get <laughs> yeah jam's more likely to kind of run off after and yeah be naughty that way but bear's more likely to do a massive jump that'll be scary she doesn't want to go in i don't want to go in either oh. go before we try and go anywhere near it you excited bear no neither of us are excited this was a stupid idea i thought it was a good idea yeah shock it came from you <laughs> look she's like mm -mm. Dun, dun, from dun. it's what you've been eating so bear you really like it it's Love yummy it. This is definitely Don't love very it. scary. Oh, bear, be brave. How am I going to get this pony to jump this? Well, that is the question. It reflects as well. <laughs> Bear's going backwards. <laughs> Bear, that is, that is the wrong direction. You're going to walk past it like a clever pony? We've booked half an hour with Dad to not chainsaw, and I'm thinking half an hour is not going to be enough. Oh. Maybe we need to open them so she can go. Yeah. <laughs> so the, the smell. bees are like, oh, is this a big blue flower? The smell wafts. Oh, she's getting closer. Oh, oh. 
thought we're in the same frame. Good girl. Smell it. See how lovely it is. Oh. Bear, sadly, this isn't enough for the vlog, just going near it. She's a little done it. Done it. She's like, okay, one, two, three, four, five. That's enough to keep me going. <laughs> if I ditch Meg, I can have a yeah. snack. Happy. So it does smell good. Right. She'll be stopping for a little nibble. Yeah. Oh, it's all slumming. Right, I'm going to have a little warm up and okay. then we'll start filming again when I get to jumping okay. the cross pole. I'll go and grab some... Um, and then we'll go in. <laughs> grab some fly spray. I've got like the same nerves I get before I go in show jumping. <laughs> this is why Bear doesn't like show jumping. <laughs> No, bear's why I don't like show jumping. You've never liked show jumping. Mum's added another bear in, by the way, guys, in case you're thinking. Where'd yeah. that come from? I didn't like having five. It, it wasn't scary enough, apparently. I thought six was better. I still want to put bales underneath the bottom as well, while I lay on their side. Yeah, well, you can get on bears to do that. We'll try that after. Um, right. A little bit of a cross pole, then? No, you need to do more show jumping. Yeah, show jumping, fine. Bail jumping. I was so excited about this at the start of this video. They're tiny. I, was... I know it's teeny, but is they're <laughs> going to jump it that size? No. Well, that's what we're going to find out. Wait and see. Right, warm up over the cross pole. <laughs> so, I have persuaded Meggy to attempt the cross pole. Let's see how this goes. Whee! <laughs> Easy peasy. Good girl, bear. I think Meg's got lockdown nerves. Oh, lovely jump. She's so fun. She is. Oh, right, call it a day, I think. No, quick spin on the other rein for that cross pole and then we're going to attempt. Dun, dun, dun. The wall of doom. Right, it doesn't help you call it like that. <laughs> What's up, Ted? I don't want to count up all my time. <laughs> Wee! Pingy pony! Have an upright before I do this. Oh, she is so demanding. All right. Brave pants on, Meg. Uh oh, I don't own any anymore. Sorry, thank you. Good girl. <laughs> she is just saving you. Never pat the pony. <laughs> <laughs> Made her jump. Right. Okay, dun, right. Dun, if, we, um, dun. if we change the uh, ground rail, I'll do the upright the other oh, way. <laughs> crying out loud. You're kidding. We should have done this live because I could have got people to vote. So I'm going to put the ground line the other way. And Meg assures me she's going to jump into the gates of Mordor this time, maybe. Okay, right, if you get in position, I'm going <laughs> to... You're going to do 10 million circles. I'm going to faint. <laughs> oh dear. That was fairly rubbish, that was my fault. I wasn't far enough back. Whee! Good girl! Oh, how good she was! See? Can I go and get my others to put them on the bottom? Hang on, let me jump it the other way. Okay. Scary, We're going to attempt it the more oh. scary way. Alright. Where are those? Whee! <laughs> She's so fun. She's epic. They decided that's Paley just fine. She's scared of something at the bottom of the school. So Hobbit wasn't satisfied with the jump. Are you joking? That big? Yeah. It's, I don't think it's very sturdy, Mum. Oh, oh, I don't know if it's safe enough. Oh, that would be a shame if it's not. <laughs> that's so wobbly. Yeah, well, that's because that's not the half white bag I'm doing. Oh, my word. Hang on. Pray for Meg, guys. Oh, my God.
Oh, girl. God, God, I was so close to bailing then. Oh, pardon the pun. <laughs> Good girl. Super duper. Sorry about the noise, guys. Now I've got them chainsawing in the woods at the bottom. Whee! <laughs> oh, she's so much fun! I love her! That was a big bear jump. Good Why am girl. I dying this way? They're getting tired in this heat. Good girl. Wow, wasn't she epic? You were so good. Have you got a special Silvermore treat for her? I certainly have. Oh, here, yeah, Bear. This is a chamomile one, guys. It is. Oh, oh bit. Oh. That was a fail. That was a fail on my part. Good girl. Like, please. Yummy. I can't believe how sensible she was. If anyone who knows Bear, was watching this beforehand, you'd have thought I was going to be sent into orbit, but she was actually incredibly sensible. She was a good girl. So good. You Clever enjoyed pony. that, didn't you, Bear? You had a fun time. Yeah, so we're right. going to get some lunch. I'm going to just like get some sugar back into my blood, and then we'll go and get jam and take it right down again. Brilliant. And then maybe Sally, Sally and Dora. Yeah, Definitely mate. not Sally and Dora. <laughs> well done, Teddy. You Super are so duper. good. Let's walk you up. So, Bear's having a little sponge. Good old hose off, bless her. She's yeah. loving it. Oh, it's and so yeah. hot, Done her hair, she's had a drink. So oh, well done, Daddy Ooh, Dead. Now you actually get to have some haylage in your stable that you've jumped. And we are going to crack straight on with jam because yeah. Dad says he doesn't want to put all his chain -soaring, chain soaring stuff back on <laughs> to then take it off again. But really, really chuffed with Bear. She is just incredible, honestly. Every time I jump this pony, I'm just like, I can't sell her. I can't sell her. She is epic, isn't she? Ugh, I just don't think I've ever had the same feeling from any other horse I've ever sat on. There, that's rubbish, hun. <laughs> Come on. She's really hiding any haylage in there? No. Right. Come on, Bo. Let's get you some haylage. You've deserved it. Ooh, just bags fall on the floor. <laughs> Come, Come on, on, dead. So, next. Pony number two. <laughs> Jam excited? Um, I don't think so. Also, what is going on? We've now got people felling the forest over there. <laughs> And people just leave the trees alone. It's typical, isn't it? As soon as you want to film a vlog. Are they drilling for oil? Like, that is so loud. I think they're just trimming them so the electricity wires can go safely through them. I don't them. know who I am. <laughs> I get nearly 10,000 views on YouTube, thank you very much. <laughs> Should I go and have a word? Yeah, if you could tell them that. <laughs> I'll go and wave at them. Red flag. <laughs> hey, Jammy. Dad, hey, go jumping. I love how she just walks straight in, though. So, looking in the complete wrong direction. Jam's not the least bit interested Jam, in the six year old that jump. has been jumping less than a year. Yeah. Like. She just walked round and round it. Had a little warm up. Whee! Tell me about Jumps and Wild. Never mind the correct lead on landing. Oh, sorry, you're a lot Good less girl. adjustable than Ted. Oh, oh, I need to learn how to ride. Oh, I ought to book in for some lessons.
Good girl. Ready? Good girl. Well done. Well done. Good girly. Clever girl. <laughs> she was like, there's a flyer! And I was like, we're not doing that. We're not doing that one. We're doing the really nice close one, Jab. Oh, Sorry. Jabby. Okay, now we'll do your one. Whee! <laughs> Put it up a bit. Meter 50 now. It's probably about 90, maybe. <laughs> if that. Cool. Oh, I'm just going to jump. Hi! Oh, Gams, they like it. <laughs> oh, why am I so pathetic? <laughs> <laughs> I can literally do one or the other. I can either blast them or I can. And hold, them. hold, hold. Poor jam. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, we're doing circles. Good girl. Oh, lovely. So Good big, girl. Good girly. Can't get the right lead or anything out the corner. But... No. Oh well. She hasn't jumped for ages. Over the fence. She's just mega. Wee. I want to make it bigger. Bigger. Um, how are we going to make it bigger? See, we could stand them on end. I don't know, maybe that'll spur at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> are you pleased with her? I can't believe her, she's so good. What a good pony. It's literally just the control I need to work on, and then, but when you get her to a fence, she's mega, isn't she? Yeah, she's just keep pleased to be out and jumping yeah. again. Right, well, I'll go and have a fiddle with the fence. Let's see what yeah. we can do. Okay, so I've pulled them up a bit, so we reckon we're on about the height. 90 i reckon i reckon 93 <laughs> 93 says meg but i was just saying because we were thinking oh we could put another load at the bottom but then jam's been so good she's only six it's the first time she's jumped in two months ages more than two months so i don't want to ruin anything so we'll probably yeah. jump this a few more times and then call it a day but yeah. how good has she been she's been brilliant maybe silvermore will uh, send us some of the other packs because they're different colors guys we could have a course Ooh. different color fence yeah purple would be good wouldn't it we could have blue yeah. and purple fences they've all, i think they've got <laughs> green jam's thinking it's more exciting than it really is she's just worried i'm gonna fire her at it again yeah <laughs> oh, sorry. That was rubbish filming. Rubbish filming, did you? For me, yeah. Oh, I lost jam. Good girl. clever ponies i can't believe how chill jam was like she's seen so little in her life and she was just completely up for jumping this so you're a superstar and bear was very good as well didn't have any crazy bear jumps which I'm not gonna lie i'm extremely surprised makes me wonder why i was nervous <laughs> anyway that's what it is do you think bear's finally growing up maybe i wouldn't don't quote me on that yeah <laughs> might just be that it's a hot sunny day and yeah exactly it's a busy Aww. week good girl but remember guys there is a giveaway currently on my instagram it's elphic.event.ponies i will have popped it up at the start of this video as well so if you want to win a voucher to get 10 bags of lovely haylage it doesn't have to be the light one it can be one of your choice and also there is a goodie bag full of treats and the swinger things i was telling you about so definitely go over check that out i think it closes on the 9th of june so if you're watching this in the future, sorry, <laughs> I'm very sorry. You just have to go buy this. <laughs> That's really nice, isn't it? We've been really impressed with it. It is absolutely lush. Jam, you've earned some too. Big, big fan. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments if you did. Let me know any other weird things you'd like me to try and jump because it was quite fun. I quite enjoyed it. 
and if you did enjoy it give it a big thumbs up make sure you subscribe to my channel we're nearly at 30,000 subscribers and the OCD in me just wants to get rid of that 29 because it's winding me up so please subscribe you like nice round numbers don't I you I do like a round number <laughs> and join us back I've got my sponsor reveal video coming very soon and I've also got a long lining video coming up on my channel so I will see you very very soon bye, bye.